His beard irritates me. I do not have a large liking for it either. I grow tired of his idea of an orderly kingdom. Some person ought to stick a blade through his face. Edward! I thought we'd agreed not to converse about such sexual topics. No, you dingus. I suggest murder. M murder is what you're suggesting? Strongly suggesting. But how would one go about such a task? We arrange ourselves in the same area with Martell, and then, when he is least expecting, I extract my sharpened rock and begin to stab away with glee. Through his eyes and through the neck, repeatedly, until his godforsaken blood pours out, meeting my rusty skin into my dry mouth as I lick feverishly I against. I believe I understand your intentions, Edward. I feel your frustration, but I myself do not wish to face a period of my life in confinement. But your life will not amount to anything, Gregory. Though that may be, I'd much rather continue farming for the nobles than to sit behind bars with a lack of food. Gregory, we did not travel such a ways to be treated with the same equality as horse feces, now did we? Edward, when you ponder more, it's not all that unpleasant. Nobody likes or cares about your opinion, Gregory. That is the reason for the night switching of beverage rations with pig semen. Excuse me? Oh, not important. Do you want to provoke a meaningful revolution, Gregory, or wallow in the filth of people better than you? I, uh, I, I quite like the filth. Oh, just look at yourself. Gander at me. We are pathetic. We appear as lowly animals. Your mother died a few years ago. A real tragedy, yes? Yes. Oh, it was a tragedy to many, Gregory. Myself, along with the other knights, we were very good friends with your mother. True tragedy, indeed. Martel, now. Martel just paid no mind to it. He truly does not care, Gregory. I would not go that far. Oh, Gregory, 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 I give up with you. Charles Martel must die. If you'd rather not make a beneficial change to our society, then so be it. However, I myself will not take it any longer. Farewell, and may God's angels grant me with a kiss on the cheek and a hug to the lips. Good day. Don't be ridiculous. Oh, but the only one ridiculous in this current situation is you, Gregory. Fine. I will aid you in your attempted murder. Why, it is nice to see you coming to your senses. I didn't know you had any. Approach him. Conduct questioning. Then I'll leap up, rock in hand, and attack. Very simple. Right. Imprisonment is simple. <laughs> what a fool. Pepin, fetch me my pony.